Hi, it's Comtech Productions. Today I'm going to show you how to make a raindrop effect in GIMP. Now what you're going to do first is you're going to make a new layer and um, you're going to get your ellipse tool and make a circle wherever you want the raindrop to be and just move it around to where you want it. And what you're going to do next is you're going to get your gradient tool and it could be whatever gradient, it doesn't really matter. As long as everything else is the same, opacity. It doesn't really matter as long as you have your gradient tool. You're just going to make a gradient. And um, what you're going to do next is go to filters. And go to light and shadow. Go to drop shadow. Make it 3. and then 70% wait for it and then it should look like this right now it doesn't really look any different at the time but it will then go to your layers and uh, click the first new layer that you made and just drag it around if you can drag it so you can see that shadow right there. You could delete it right now too. You don't really need this anymore. And uh, you're going to go to filters, light and shadow, and drop shadow. Make it negative three. Negative three. And thirty percent. Alright, now you have this nice shadowy thing look. So, um, what you're going to do next is you're simply going to go to the brush tool right here. And you're going to choose the circle fuzzy one. And make sure that your brush size is going to fit inside the raindrop itself. It's going to be like near the corner. And don't make it too big, just make it so it could fit the corner right here, like that. Oh yeah, and make sure you have your foreground color is white. Click OK, and just click once or twice. Twice works for me. And click Edit, I mean Select, and None should look like that and just click on the background layer if you want to see how it looks and as you can see it looks really nice uh so yeah that's how you make a raindrop in gimp and thanks for watching